Hello students, welcome to Adi Chemistry's online coaching. Today we will explore the concept of activation energy. By the end, you will understand exactly what is activation energy and its significance in determining the rate of chemical reactions. I am Aditya Vardhan, creator of AdiChemistry.com from Varangal. Let us examine the reaction between molecules A2 and B2 which leads to the creation of two AB molecules as is typical in chemical reactions the initial step involves the breaking of existing bonds followed by the subsequent formation of new bonds between the A and B atoms. In this particular reaction, the pre-existing bonds within the A2 and B2 molecules are initially broken and we know that a certain amount of energy is required to break these bonds. Under normal conditions, the reactant molecules lack sufficient energy to break the existing bonds. They must acquire an additional amount of energy to accomplish this. As depicted on the screen, the reactant molecules must overcome an energy barrier in order to undergo a chemical reaction. The difference between the energy of normal molecules and this energy barrier is known as activation energy. It simply represents the additional energy required by the regular molecules to surpass the energy barrier. The energy barrier represents the minimum amount of energy that should be possessed by the molecules to undergo a chemical reaction and this is normally referred to as threshold energy. Therefore, the activation energy is defined as the difference between energy of normal molecules under standard conditions and the threshold energy possessed by the reactant molecules to undergo a chemical reaction. By the way, since 1982, according to IUPAC, 0 degree Celsius and 100 kilopascals are defined to be the standard conditions. Remember this. Now let us see the relation between activation energy and rate of a chemical reaction. The chemical reactions associated with smaller activation energies are faster. The specific rate of a chemical reaction is given by E power minus Ea by Rt where Ea is activation energy and T is temperature while R is universal gas constant. Now test your understanding by stating the following statement is true or false. The minimum amount of energy possessed by the reactant molecules to undergo a chemical reaction is known as activation energy. Had to state whether this statement is true or false. Your time starts now. It is a false statement. Actually, it is called threshold energy and not the activation energy. Try another statement. The activation energy is equal to threshold energy minus energy of normal reactant molecules under standard conditions. Your time starts now. State whether this statement is true or false. Yes, it is a true statement. 
it is from the definition now try this one the activation energies of chemical reactions change with temperature your time starts now it is a false statement because by definition the activation energy of a particular chemical reaction is a fixed quantity unless the standard conditions are redefined visit adhikamistry.com for more information on this topic or search for adhikamistry activation energy you can also find links to worksheets and other study material in the description section if you find it difficult to reach them don't hesitate to ask me in the comment section or drop an email to adikemadi at gmail.com okay all the best don't forget to like share and subscribe